It is now time to open up round number three in this year's back to track as Mercury Swirl and Blue Wombat will be playing in this game. Well, what a game this is going to be for the round three opener. Blue Wombat, the best marble of the season, without a doubt. Currently the third seed for this year's back to track tournament and such a phenomenal season for Blue Wombat so far, winning the balance jump championship and already starting off 2-0 here in back to track. Almost lost in her game against Freezing H2O in round two, though. Freezing H2O had such a great game in that one and looked like Freezing H2O was going to be able to take away that game in the end, but Blue Wombat still able to win. Mercury Swirl with wins against Greg of the Polka Dot and Icy Blue. Not great competition. So 2-0 so far. Mercury Swirl has played pretty well. He's the number nine seed as of right now. But this game against Blue Wombat is going to be the huge test for Mercury Swirl. And if he can win this game, I think that he is going to be a force to be reckoned with. But anyway, let's begin this game right now. All right, let's begin round number three in this back to track tournament right now. We roll a four on the dice roll right here for this Mercury Swirl versus Blue Wombat contest. But anyway, we'll start in the balance jump and we'll end in the maze race. Second unit will be the time drees. Uh, Mercury Swirl will kick us off right here in this balance jump and he'll get to the 10 to start. Not a good way to start, especially against this Blue Wombat marble. Balance jump champion. Blue Wombat will get to the 10 as well. So not a good start for either marble. It's going to remain zero to zero. All right, the second try is now underway. Blue Wombat will be going up for her second, and she'll improve from the first. She gets 20. All right, so now it is time for the second try for Mercury Swirl. Mercury Swirl will get all the way to the 40. What a second try for him, and that is going to give him two points to start, so 2 nothing, Setting the tempo right here early, and I would say Mercury Swirl, what a start for him today, 33. And now, Blue Wombat. Oh, this is going to be a slow one. Mercury Swirl on an upset. Watch right here. 38. Three points for Mercury Swirl there. 5 nothing. All right. Blue Wombat will get a 32. Had a very slow ending on that. That could have easily been in the 20s if she didn't slow down there. Mercury Swirl had a slow ending too. And that's going to be a 34 for him. So, one point for Blue Wombat. Now, it's 5 to 1. All right. Now, in the maze race, Mercury Swirl is trying to close this game out. He'll need one more point in this maze race to be able to clinch the victory. And Mercury Swirl will be able to do that. Mercury Swirl is going to win this game. And he'll move up to 3-0 to start back to track. What a start for this marble. Mercury Swirl has not seen much success throughout his career. But is on pace to do it in this year's back to track tournament. Mercury Swirl will close out this maze race now. He'll end it out at 3 to 1. And the final score in this uh, back to track game will end at 9 to 1. And so far, every opening round game, the final score will be 9 to 1. And in all of the round opening games, I'm finding that a little bit suspicious as of right now. If the round 4 opener game ends at 9 to 1 as well, then we might have a problem. But anyway. Mercury Swirl with the 8-point victory, and Mercury Swirl, he'll bring his point differential up to plus 20. He is 3-0 and as of right now and gets a big upset over Blue One, but doesn't just beat her. He blows her out just a little bit. Well, I must say, I think Mercury Swirl is very legit in this year's back-to-track tournament after beating Blue Wombat, the number one marble in the league after winning the Balance Jump Championship and then starting off 2-0 and in back-to-track. So expect to see big things from Mercury Swirl in this year's Back to Track tournament. And we just might see him in the big dance for this year's Back to Track tournament. But anyway, thank y'all very much for watching this. I will see y'all later for some more games coming up.